do Palestinians have right to full sovereignty in making their own decision without interference from you or Israel, for instance? Like if they choose any group you and Israel doesn't like to rule their lands and something like that, are you going to impose any sanction on them or not? Because like you don't impose any sanction on Israel when they don't like uh, follow your like decision or like they don't apply your ideas or something like that. Like so, I'm not like do Palestinians they have I, the same right? Like, I, I'm not. I, I, we, so I'm not sure what you mean by choosing um, uh, uh, a group to to rule their own land. I would say that we, like we I say we ab- let me just say we absolutely support the Palestinian people's right to self-determination to fulfill their legitimate aspirations and that's why it has been the policy of the, the United States and is one that we have actively pursued to try to establish an independent Palestinian state and yeah, it can do, we continue to believe that is in the best interest of the Palestinian people and also in the interest of yes. the, the government of Israel. Like, and that, that, is, that is what we are pursuing. True. Like, like for a like concrete example, like Palestinians in 2006, they chose Hamas to rule Gaza in this time. Like, so it means... And we see how that has worked out for everyone in the region, quite yeah, terribly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, this is like Palestinian decision. I'm uh, Egyptian, not Palestinian. <laughs> right. But like, I'm just saying, like, this still is like a Palestinian issue. Like we see China like hosting them for negotiation. So like it means Palestinians themselves still recognize Hamas as a part of Palestinians and they go China, go Russia, go Global South. And it seems like complicated. Like how you say, look at this complicated uh, uh, choosing people at, at the end so, of the day, all of them are Palestinian. So we reject um, a terrorist organization <laughs> controlling any government anywhere in the world. The bottom line policy of the United States, something that we reject, something that we do not uh, support. And we believe that most Palestinians don't want to see a terrorist organization govern the Palestinian people. If you look at the results of a terrorist organization governing Hamas, it has been a war that has wreaked widespread destruction on Gaza and led to the death of more than 40,000 Palestinians. So. Now, or is it? They told well, no, I, I, I'll just say, but the, the, what we want to see is a pathway to two states, the state of Israel and an independent Palestinian state. And that's what we're going to continue to try to pursue. There's just no other way to, to put it than that. Go ahead.